Excellent. So it took me a little while to get ready, like mentally, to to play this game again. I um after the last stream, I was scared so badly during during that stream that like it took me a couple of days <laughs> to not be upset about it, you know? Um, and then I just, you know, ended up taking a couple extra days just, just cause, but, and yeah, wireless witchcraft, it's, I, I, I don't understand it, but it's cool. It's very cool. But I don't know how, I don't know how far we're going to get in this game tonight. Uh, but if, if it gets, like, crazy scary again, I might just, like, call it for the day. Uh, we'll see. <gasps> Alright. Against all my better judgment. Let's remember where we left off, shall we? So we still haven't found the secret room, right? Where's the secret passage? Yeah, we still haven't found the secret passage. I want to read this again. The light coming out of the vault gave me a vision of, a cli of climbing a spiral staircase to a room near the top of a tower. We've, we've been there. We've been to the room at the top of the tower with the mural. One of the stranger's inhabitants pointed at a mural of an identical tower beneath beneath a ringed planet, then picked up an artifact and carried it downstairs to a room with a green fire. Sometime later, several lamps in the mural room turned on while others turned off, plunging the mural into darkness and revealing a secret passage. Okay. My best guess is that we go to the tall tower in night mode in dreamland um with our artifact and then we go up to the or down to where the fire would be but i th i don't know we're gonna have to fiddle with that i don't totally understand what to do there what else is here a narrow gorge along the rightmost branch of the river. There are dwellings built into both cliff faces high above. Okay. I remember that. That was, like, where we were for all of the last stream. And then this is that, that thing. Yeah. And we don't know how to unlock those yet. I have uh, some ideas, but I haven't worked it out yet. Interesting. Alright, well, we might as well. Um, actually, let's make sure to mark the stranger. And then we can just go. I have nothing to be nervous about. It's all gonna be fine. It's all gonna be fine. One thing that's kind of funny is I'm, I'm like, I'm not eager to finish the game because I, I don't want it to be over, right? But also, I'm excited to not have to worry about spoilers anymore. That will be, that will be nice. Um, now which entrance do I want to go to? Uh, if we're going to the tower, we might as well just take the main entrance. If we're going anywhere else, I'll just, I'll go this way first.
That's a... Up, up, up. Oh yeah, and there was... I missed it. I missed it again. There was another building that I wanted to go back to. Um, which I think was these ones. I kind of wanted to go back to these ones. We'll just leave that there. We're, we're going to check out some of the neighboring buildings. been all over that building. Although we never did parse out the chanting room with all the chanting guys. I don't know if I'm ready to dive back in with that, though. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure I've fully explored this area. Yeah, there's the ring up here. What's up this way? Ooh, there's another one. I don't recall this one. I, like, I wish I, I was, like, writing down which ones I had found. Because some of them are in the logs and some of them, it seems like, aren't. Alright, so if I have this, I can go over to this building and I'm pretty sure there's a projector in here. Or no. No, there was a projector in this room. Before I run all over the place. Yeah, here it is. So I can put that there and then just go get a lamp. I should stop wasting all of my fuel. Doors closing. Spooky guy lights the thing. Yep, and that turns on the ch Yeah, so this is familiar to me. So, like, we can extinguish the chains using those weird tower things, but don't know where to find them. Oh, that was new? Was that really new? I'll check the other one then, just, just to be safe, because I thought that I had looked at all of these. And maybe I'm wrong, but just on the off chance, while we're here, I was certain we had looked at these. This one I remember looking at last stream. His face. He's so enlightened. We got a bunch of burned. And they travel over to like observe the eye. And that's the whole thing. Okay. Ah, oh, sorry. I've got, like, this... A hair or something. It's driving me nuts. Okay. Uh, okay. So, I guess... Now we'll grab... the uh, artifact
Nice, just made it. Don't worry about the ghost matter. There's like several of them in here. Bunch of broken ones too. This is this must have been like their workshop. Okay. I'm sorry, one second. I'm just gonna blow my nose or something. I gotta get <laughs> I've got to get this itch to leave me alone. Hold on. Okay, better. Sorry about that. Gotta get my blanket, get cozy again. All right. And we're gonna go back to this tower here. I'm getting a little better at navigating these, like, rapids. Pick me up! Pick me up! Thank you. Alright, I'm gonna grab some fuel since we- I guess it doesn't really matter, but just in case we need it at some point. down, pick this up, put it down, pick it up, put it down. We go back to our secret door na doorway number one. We say hi to our friends and join the huddle. How do I get to you? I w we will figure this out. Okay. Also, I wonder if I can see, probably not from here, that spot where we got just like destroyed by that guy that's like forever just gonna be like a a trauma spot for me while playing just like don't go over there don't do it uh okay and then it was somewhere here it is so under the tower that has the light, which is where we are now, we can go up to the top and then go back in here where the guys are. 
I suppose we'll go up and either extinguish everything or light everything. One of the two. There is a secret passage in here somewhere, and we will find it. So, in here... That light is out. I'm wondering, should we extinguish everything or leave it all lit? Some candles will go out and some will remain. Is that the exact text? Shit, I wish we could check it. Uh, let's just leave them all lit since we lit that one. We're gonna go back down. Alright. We're gonna go back up. We're gonna go all the way around. And then we go where we light the fire. Right? So we're here now with the fire lit. Unless maybe now we're supposed to wake up? Which is possible? Because I can't do anything there. I can't like sit or change anything. Man, I should... Oh, well, I'm gonna wake up. We're gonna wake up. Uh, you know what? Let's see if that worked. Let's just see if something opened at the top when we're awake now. Kind of doubt it. I think I need to read my ship log again to really know what the heck is going on here. And the easiest way to get in there, I think, is just to wait until the dam breaks. We might be able to do it now. But I think we have to... We have to get in there from, like, underneath or something. But the dam's gonna break, like, any second, right? Look at that. Yeah, any second now. Oh, that's not what I wanted to happen. Oh, that's not what I wanted to happen. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's gonna be fine. We're just gonna get out of the water and we'll be okay. Bridge! Hello! How is the rest of your stream? Everything, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, we're fine. <laughs> uh. Man, I'm so nervous to do like anything in this game after last stream. Stream's good, how's the DLC? Uh, yeah, it's good so far, we just started. Um, I will say that like, the last stream had me, like, genuinely afraid. Uh, come on. There we go. Um, to the point where I'm, like, really hesitant to experiment. <laughs> I just really don't want to get jump scared again.
The dudes that blew the lights out are spooky as heck. Yeah, but it's, oh man. Especially that one that got me because I just really wasn't expecting it. All right, so we're back in here, right? Gosh. I feel so slow for not getting this. Um, I'm tempted to just restart the loop to look at my thing again. Look at the log. One, two. Okay. Let's... I wonder if there's any, like, areas in here that I just, like, 100% haven't been to yet. Like, I've been down this path. Orc, hello! How are ya? Uh, man. Oh, no, I missed! It's fine, it's fine. You know what, I'm actually just gonna restart the loop. Uh, I, I want to reread my log again and maybe write some of it down so that I can reference it more easily. Uh, of course, all my paper has writing on both sides. Ah, uh, this doesn't. <laughs> Scrap of paper acquired. You're working out. Have a good workout. Good luck. I'm doing okay. Yeah, I'm, d I'm doing all right. Come on. Yep, okay. Every everything's fine. Uh, log. Okay. Secret passage. The light coming out of the vault gave me a vision of climbing a spiral staircase to a room on the top floor. One of the stranger stranger's inhabitants pointed at a mural of an identical tower beneath a ringed planet, then picked up an artifact and carried it downstairs to a room of the green fire. So, what gets me about this is that, so several lamps in, a mur in the mural room turned on while others turned off, plunging the mural into darkness and, and revealing a secret passage. That sounds like the one to just get into the dream world, right? That doesn't sound like a different passage. That sounds like where we've already been. I should have looked at that ring again. The the maybe maybe we should do that. So, he must do something in that main room to get to the secret passage, right? And that's only in the main area. There's one detail that is poorly worded there. Okay.
the video itself may make clear if you feel stuck. Okay, like the like the reel, because that's what I was thinking is I'll go and get that reel again that's in there, and I should have grabbed it while I was there, but I, I don't know, I just didn't think to. Um, I just really want to find this spot. <laughs> Let's, where am I? Okay. I don't think it was a real, it was the vision from the thing that's locked up. Hmm. If it was something that I just saw one time, I have no memory of it. If it's something I can't look at again. Oh, I didn't grab the... I forgot to grab the... Uh... I don't know if I can get to it now. I can try. Got to grab the artifact. Oh, I might be able to get to it. Picture mode. Hey, figured it out. Where is it? There it is. Ugh. Gimme. Just in case I need it, you know? I guess we can go out this way. What? What? Come on. Oh, I was worried. <laughs> Just leave it there. It's like leaving your coffee on top of your car and then driving away. <laughs> so... The other question is, can I get into that room this early without the thing falling? Because it is beneath this rock formation, right? Oh, maybe it's right there. Maybe it's there and maybe I can stay on my raft. Keep rotating. Secret tunnel, secret tunnel through the mountain. I'm so impatient just flying through this. Okay, here we are. We have a matching light that's out. Do I... I'm trying to look at it.
I wonder what would happen if we extinguished all the lights except for this one so that they're like opposite. Like maybe that would do it. I kind of want to try that first. If only I had two hands. But miraculously, I do not. I thought that was a path up. I was wrong. Fifty percent fuel remaining. Excellent. It is nice that they put a little refueling station right there. Let's go back. We're going to go and unlock that taller room real real quick ignore the footsteps just don't think about it don't even notice it The light in that mural was like out here, which is also interesting. Uh, okay. So now we're gonna go back up. Okay. I feel like this should be telling me more also. Like, I get that this is the daylight one, but I, I don't know what I'm actually learning from that mural, if anything, but. Now let's leave. We've got the one light on that we want. And we're just gonna wake up. We're gonna wake ourselves up and see if anything's different. Hurl ourselves into the water. <gasps> All right. Come on. What it sounds like we have to do is like open one of these, you know, but we tried that. I mean, I guess it's not too late to try it again, but. We are also gonna lose our, uh, 
our dam any minute. Go back up. Oh, there we go. Hey, flexed my brain power, and we are here now. Uh, open. That one's burned. That's burned. Oh, wait, that's, a, that's, um, that's a code. That's a code. Okay, okay. We got, uh, semi, the, uh, the crescent moon. Saturn, crescent moon, star. Oh, cool. That's the first one we found. Ooh, here's another one. Okay. And then we've got a sun. I'm trying to draw these, like, relatively similarly to how they are. That's, it's fine. Um, and then fire. And then another one of these semicircle things. I'll show you my, uh, my crappy three second fire drawings. All right, here are my codes. Here we go. It's fine, we're just gonna tilt a little bit. No biggie, no biggie. Um, and then I want to close this. So this is correlating to a f fire symbol, but everything looks kind of like burned. So this is a, a ring with kind of like a, a burned thing and then a, a big fire. I have to I have to take as many notes as possible so I don't have to come back. <laughs> All right, and then this one it looks like a kind of satellite grabby arm thing. With little lasers. I could take a picture. But I won't. And then... Those we just don't understand yet. Okay, so we found a secret passage. Very exciting. <laughs> Grats, thank you. Uh, now where can we use those? I know that there is one over here that we could potentially try those codes on, and then the other ones are in the underground layer. Um, but we need three for the underground layer, so... Maybe we should just... Oh, we can't go there now because it's all underwater. I don't think we can get back up. Maybe we can. No, I think we can, actually. We'll try it. Didn't think we'd take damage there, but it's fine. Oh, 
I don't know if we'll be able to make it from here. We'll try. Oh, maybe we can. It's nice that they let you go against the current a little bit in some spots. Going around all the loops every time would be a little tedious. Don't pass it. Oh, shit. I thought that this was it. And I fucked up. Mm, okay. Uh, we'll meditate. We'll just go straight there. And then we'll have more time to, like, explore that area anyways. The river riding music's your favorite. It's so good. It's really, really good. We can also read what our ship's log said about that whole area. Good morning. Off we go. Oh, we did it. And it shows us the code right here, at least one of them, but not the second one, which is kind of weird. A secret room filled with wooden containers marked with different symbols. Three of the containers are marked with glowing vault seals, but their contents have been burned away. I opened a container marked with a symbol of a burning slide reel and found a vertical sequence of symbols inside. What about the other one with the little satellite arms with the little laser doohickeys? That one's gotta mean something, too. Oh, the other one's just somewhere else. Okay. Interesting. All right, well, now we have it, regardless. That's weird. So I'll stumble across it sometime in the future, but it's just not displayed yet. Huh. All right, well, whatever. It's fine. Ugh. We'll go grab our favorite artifact while we're right here. I think it's just good practice to always have one with you. I will say, one thing I'm missing about the original game in this DLC is the scale, I think, of the original game. Um, this game just feels smaller in comparison. Like, we've got this one cool area to explore, as opposed to the other game where you had, like, you know, just an entire solar system <laughs> with a whole bunch of planets. Maybe it'll open up more later. I 
I'm also pretty sure that I saw one of those code things, like, way earlier in the game. Um, like, on the first time that I played it, I remember looking at one and being like, I don't know what this does, and just ignoring it, and I've never seen it again after that. I don't know if I'm just gonna have to go looking at some point to try to find it. I did? Okay. I, I'm glad I'm not crazy. So there's one that I probably already passed. Which is probably the one that I need to go to. Because if I was a game designer, that's how I would do it. I would make the first code that you found work with the first, like, puzzle piece that you find. But we're already here, so we'll do this one first. And now the question is, where was it exactly? Um, I think it was on this side? Uh, it was in one of the bigger houses. I think it was in here. Maybe, oh, I bet it's in there. No, maybe not. It's not in the other side, is it? We've looked at all of these. I can say that. Confidently. Oh, there's one here. I'll remember that maybe. Uh, we didn't look in this one. I wanna go in here. Let me in. Oh, that looks cool. I wanna go in there. But there's a door. It's the wrong way. Uh, that goes out of the building. Okay. So it's not this one. Sorry for all just, like, the looping around and all the repetition. I guess that kind of just is this game, though. And I don't think it was this building. I've seen that symbol before. I have seen that symbol before. How do I... There we go. So for this one, it's go in between the two trees and then you're clear, right? Yeah. I can just grab this and take it with me. Pyro! Pyro, thank you so much for the raid. How did the rest of your stream go? Challenger Tabletop, hello. Kira Pizza, hello. Wait, what's wait?
You can't at yourself. Well, hold on. Everybody here, if you weren't already following Friendly Pyro, you should you should go do the thing. Pyro is a wonderful artist and a great friend. Oh yeah, sorry, it's set up for mods only. Bridge, do you want to be a mod? I'll make you a mod. Okay, okay. But yeah, go do the thing. Pyro is great people. Wonderful art community over there. Oh, the music. And I love to just like work on my art projects and, and chill out in there. Okay, I wrote down the combination for this one. We can do this. We found the combination and we're gonna do it. We've got we've got crescent moon. We've got Saturn. We've got another crescent moon, and then we've got two stars. That's that's it. There we go. Oh shit. Okay. The stream was good. Got most of the way done. Uh, for, with the codes for on the boys. Just highlights left. That's my favorite part is the highlights. They really like bring the piece together. Um, totally up to me if I'm looking for mo your mo uh, for more mods. You'll help when you can. Hey, I'm always looking for more mods. Um, yeah, if anybody in chat is like ever interested in being a mod, let me know because I often often am uh, looking for mods. Where'd I find it? So I found the code in the secret room in that tall building that we were searching on end. Um, so the solution was that in one of the buildings, um, actually I think I can do this right now, right? Oh, I, I might have to do it off stream because I think that if I give you mod, it'll take away the VIP. Um, so it might bounce if I try to do it right now. But anyways, um, we found the secret room by matching the candles in the dream world and the, the real world. We switched them to be opposite and it worked. It opened up a secret passage. Uh, I'm afraid of where this goes, but we're going to find out. Oh, it didn't go far. That's good. Is there... Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was like, if, if there's something missing here that we need, I will... That's where we are. Right? That's where we are. Where is this? <laughs> Dream World, Freddy Krueger? <laughs> That's right outside. That's in that building that gets destroyed when the water comes. This is immediately at the entrance, right? So I want to make sure I got close enough that it updated the ship log. Okay. Um, other things that are in here. Is this... No! Come back! <laughs> We've got a new reel to investigate. Um, I guess we should go check these areas out. Starting maybe with that one. All right, well. Oh. 
Interesting. This game with its questions. How did I get in here? Uh, this way takes me out. Oh, perfect. Oh, you love it. You gotta love it. Now, we just need a lamp, which I guess we'll go back for. Unless there's just, like, one right out here. Just, just check. Check your nearby surroundings before committing to a long trek. Okay. Long trek it is. Unless there's one down here? No. This building is safe. We don't have to stress about light. Oh, here we go. I knew I'd seen one. Ugh. Let me up. Alright. The bell descends. Oh god, they're so evil looking. <laughs> it's a lot of reels. They're taking them all. And scanning them? And then destroying them. So they scanned all of their knowledge into potentially whatever is in the bell. That's my working theory. That is my working theory. Uh, not that one. I just want to leave. <laughs> How do I get out of here? So I think it was... Oh, oh, it was this building. It's that room right there, right? Right? That's the one it was pointing at? How do I get to you? Maybe it's easier to drop down. Or no, you can't drop down. You have to climb up. Okay. fine. What if I go up here? Can I... Ugh. If I send it up too early... Oh, man. If I send it up and try to jump on it, it's gonna go too fast, yeah. Fuck. Fuck! Shit. I need to get there. Nothing else in this world matters. I need to get in that room. But I can't! Okay. Damn it. 
I want to get up there so bad. Okay. Um, you're biting your tongue so hard. Listen. I'll figure it out. Um... Because I can't go across and then up. Right? I'm kind of stuck here. I believe I am stuck here. Ugh. No, it's broken. It, it, um, you can't call the elevator back down. Yeah, I, I did that. And, uh, as soon as I sent it back up, I was like, shit. I'm fucked. Because <laughs> even here, like, I don't think I can get across. Oh, maybe I can. <gasps> I totally can. Take that, game. Okay. Oh! Oh, I figured it out. Ha ha! I can just send it down, and then I can go over. Easy! Baby game. This game's for babies. Spooky. Yeah, this... I mean, it doesn't help that there's a bunch of spooky music. And then a spooky dude over here with his light. We're in the safe world. We're in the safe world. Nothing can hurt us here. Right? Oh. Uh. I I'm upset. I'm I'm really upset. I don't I don't know what to do. Uh can I put it back? Please let me out. I just... Must have been a little bit too late. Yes! Ha! 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 Oh, I, f I feel great. How do I get out? Pyro, you're gonna lurk, get some food. Enjoy your food. Have a great dinner. Oh, no, not the music. This is the worst time. Fuck. <laughs> oh, let me read this. Just let me read this. All right, we got some spooky guys around the third reel.
We've got the door. That's the stage. Okay, we're at the stage. Oh my god, there's a secret platform at the stage. And it goes to that building, which we've been there before. Okay, I need to look at this again. It's in between the two candles. There's a bridge, and you can walk across. Oh my god, that's crazy. Hey, Killer Ducky, how's it going? This opens a secret pass- a secret passage. To here. Where- this- is this in that building, I wonder? It must be, right? It is, yeah, okay. Dang. Okay. All right. We got some answers. We got some stuff to work with. Uh, what I don't like is that we're going to have to go back to Dream World. Not looking forward to that. Insane timing just before reset. I have had that happen many times. <laughs> there have been so many times where I've gotten a reel or something like right as the music starts and I'm just like frantically trying to read through the whole thing. <gasps> okay. Well, I'm glad that we're figuring some stuff out because I was just a little bit worried when I started stream that I was going to spend the whole stream just like experimenting and troubleshooting and not getting anywhere. <laughs> but that has not been the case. Oh my god, there's so much more to explore. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, Alright, let's just go through a couple of these. So the abandoned temple. Entering the, quick se the correct sequence opens up a path to a secret room beneath the temple. I found a slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants removing all the slide reels from their shelves, scanning each reel with a device, and incinerating specific slides as well as entire reels. I can't get over how it locked me in and then taught me how to get out. That was so cool. It was horrifying, but it was really cool. A room full of burned slide reels piled next to a strange device. I found a hidden slide reel that shows container marked with glowing symbol being handed to a shadowy figure. Um... The lights, uh, the lights are extinguished and the figure carries the container into a secret passage behind a mural of a large tree. Oh yeah, and then all of these. A projector seems to reveal a secret location somewhere within the stranger. That is so unhelpful. You can barely see it. And then this is like the very first area. Yeah, no mention of the invisible bridge. There's, there's gotta be, right? A map I found in the abandoned temple of real secret location. And then that one. Secret mural. Yeah, I have found that the in my opinion anyways the dlc relies substantially more on your memory than the base game like you really have to remember where you've been and what you've done and where you found things um i also didn't mark the location of the stranger but i really want to get enough into orbit that we're not going to crash down again this time i thought i did this but it must i must have clicked something else that wiped it
I also want to find that other code area. Um, we have so many different things that we can investigate now. We have so many different leads, which is really cool. We could go straight over there. Like, that was one of the spots, right? It was either that one or that. Let's just explore these buildings a little bit more. This is... The, the, like, surprise, you made it into the new area, right? Yeah. This is just an entrance. That takes you down that way. This is where our, our uh, artifact is. This we explored recently. Unless there is something like hidden here. I don't think this is the building that it was trying to take us to, but... So we've looked at all this. I don't think it's this building. Think there's any buildings on that side? Huh. Because I think it's that building that's in the thing, but I don't see anywhere where there could be a, uh, a hidden passage. Oh, what? I can't climb this roof? Just taking my ship's log everywhere I go. That was where we started. I'm just taking a quick look-see. Just to make sure we didn't miss anything weird. Nope. I don't think so. So then, process of elimination, there must be a hidden passage here. And we just haven't looked closely enough. fairly sure there's nothing here. A 
only other idea is that maybe there's like a passage underneath or something, but I think that's a solid no. Which one was it? We don't have a ton of time for this location. And I don't know if this is the one that we really want to use to explore anyways, because this is the one that has all the guys that are awake. I'm trying to remember exactly where the, uh, where the, um, I'm trying to remember where the stage is. So how we'll get there the fastest. Because I don't think it's here. I don't think this is the one that we want to use for that. Oh, I don't remember. Crap. And I know that they're like all connected and stuff, but I know that some are like closer and easier to navigate than others. Remember the vision? of the stage he walked across a high cavern. Yeah, no, I, I remember, I remember that. Oh, so maybe it would be better to go in through this entrance. I just know that this one, it's easy to get the boat. It's easy to get the boat and then to run around that way. Oh, I don't even have this, the artifact. Shit, okay. So, maybe we should definitely go that way anyways. <laughs> Just because there is an artifact over there. Figure this out. I'm gonna get there. Still lurking, no sound. No worries, Pyro. Thanks for the reminder. Okay. It's broken. See? I told you. I thought it only broke after the dam broke, though. I am disappointed. I am really 
excited to learn about the doors, though, and how to potentially get around some of them. The issue is I have no recollection of where there are doors that I couldn't get through. <laughs> Fuel level critical, it's fine. We're going to be underwater soon, don't worry about it. Also, like, we still can't get through these ones. We can't, it's not all doors. It's just a couple of doors. Yep, I know how to get through here. Oh, whoops. Nope, I don't. <laughs> there we go. I was so confidently incorrect there. So... Oh, am I misremembering? I think I am misremembering. There's not a, a, a bunch of guys here. Yeah, this area doesn't have an entrance to the dream world. I thought that there was one here. Am I going crazy? Maybe it's on the other side. Go around. Between. Okay. I thought it was there. Oh, it's that. Oh, I'm such a dummy. Oh, I gotta be quick because the bridge is gonna fall too. Ah! It's fine. We made it. It's fine. This one? We just try each one until we get it. Or not. There we go. It's always the one that has the the the, uh, the Saturn planet. I don't know why I'm always unsure. Ah, uh, yes. the where's the place though this is that secret room secret building we got into that room You had to draw maps you got lost all the time. Yeah, I mean, I'm not far from that, to be honest. Um, I wish I could just drop down there. <laughs> Whew, 
This area freaks me out. I got into that room. Oh, that's... Oh god, I'm gonna die. Fuck. Shit. I forgot that I didn't have jet fuel. My bad. <laughs> cheater, cheater. Oh, hey, at least we don't have to do this again. That's nice. Don't do that again. Oh yeah, we got our grabby hand. I wonder if we can open that door now. Oh no, because we can't throw our scout. I was so excited about what we learned and now I'm like... Maybe it was useless information. I'm sure it's not, but... I hate it every time. We got another door there. don't know if I can get to where I want to be from here. That takes me back. Oh, gosh. Okay. I think... I kind of want to restart the loop. Oh, God. I don't even remember. Well, we learn how we get down there. That's how we get down here, right? But to open the door, we have to be in another place. And I... Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Oh, that's it, isn't it? That's where we have to get to. To get up there. Man, if we have to like go to one location and then go to the other. It could be down there too. I'm also like so paranoid about going off the path even a little because a guy will spawn and he will startle me. All right, uh, let's let's dive off the edge and wake back up. Uh, should we? Fuck. <sighs> oh god! All right, wake up! I don't want to be here anymore. I missed a turn in the house. Do I want to hit? Uh, no, thank you. 
I request no hints. If I do need help, I will very expressly ask chat. Um, but that's the end of the loop anyways. So let's meditate. I feel like I remember getting to the stage more easily. And I, I didn't think it was from that area. I thought it was a different area. Um, you know what else I'm gonna do? I mean, just let the ship fly itself while I look at the ship log. I don't know why I've never done this before. Okay. Oh, well. I just fluffed up my flight trajectory. It's fine. So... It's like a thing off to the off to the side. Let's do this first. Let's do that first. So it's off to the side of that room. Just like a little sewer kind of thing that was in there. Ah! No. There we go. Okay. ship says come back don't go you're just gonna die and I'm gonna loop again is it in here if so game that's very sneaky of you it's very sneaky good more of these rooms love it Oh, I love it. Oh, it gives me goosebumps. <laughs> All right. that on the first try <laughs> oh, I just realized if I hadn't gotten that on the first try I would have been screwed <laughs> uh, did I pick up the reel okay good what 
Where does this go? Ah, hidden passage. Very cool. So we still need a light. The question becomes, where is the fastest room to get a light from? It's probably this way, because there were a bunch. A bunch, I mean one, exactly one. But you know what, one's all we need. Outer Wild is a complicated racing game, discuss. <laughs> it kind of feels that way. I mean, when you've got this timer all the time, it's like you really gotta use your time wisely. All right. Uh, this is the entrance. We, I have recognized this. Oh, they're taking it in there to have their chanty moment. What? And he just walks right through? He walks right through the fire. Maybe I have to go there, like, right at the very end of the loop or something? Because every time I've gone there and I, like, wait, I they have a guy come and grab me. Okay. All right, so we've got one down. I mean, we are right here. I don't really want to do that one right now. I'd rather go back and try to find the other one. We do have a lot of time, though. <sighs> they don't go through it, like, right away. I've, I've waited, and I've, like, waited on the stairwell and stuff, but they, they always are just standing there. I don't know if I'd be able to, like, get past them or, or what. The last room... was higher up. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. That reel seemed to really strongly correlate with the with the closest entrance. So how am I, what am I going to call it? The other one, I think, correlates to this one. I think this is the easiest way to get to the um to get to the uh uh. Do I have an artifact? Fuck, I don't have an artifact. The stage area. Because I think that's how I did it last time. I could be wrong, but I'm, I'm pretty sure that's how I did it last time. Yes! I did. I did figure out the hidden passage here. That's how we got the code. Um, uh, 
Ugh, man. I guess I, I do just have to keep going, though, because I don't have an artifact. gonna do this what is the plan I think the plan is we're gonna go up we're gonna grab the artifact we'll go back into dream world we'll take another look around at this entrance because it's here this one also gives us the most amount of time um There is also a hidden passage here that we haven't found yet, but it's on the other side. That might be the next loop that we commit to try to find finding that. Um I'm fairly sure that to get the artifact don't we have to go all the way around? Or is it just in here? There it is. Yes! Ha ha! I used my brain and remembered things. Alright, we don't need to do all of them. Just that one. Okay. Get all the paths lit up. Light that guy. And we'll come back over here for a moment. We can go all the way back around and unlock that door. I'm not sure if it's worth it right now. Um... What freaks me out is just this guy that's in there. I, like, really don't want to upset him, you know? Amazing that the footsteps don't make him question anything. Uh. 
freaks me out. It's fine. Good lord, this area makes me nervous. think we missed anything. Oh. Uh, it's just so rude. Like, the game devs definitely didn't have to put that noise in. They chose to. They, they did that to us. Fuck, how do I get back? Just this way. I just went all the way around, didn't have to. Take me back. So we can get all the way across here. This takes us to the boat. Right. Whoa, almost walked off. Almost walked off, didn't though. So that takes us to the boat. Which I guess we're going to do. I think we're going to do that. We're going to go to the boat. It feels a little incorrect. But. That's what I got. No, god damn it. Thought I was in it. Come back. Get back up here. We've been to the bell before. I don't think we need to check out the bell again. I want to go around some more.
Yeah, this is the area that I kind of remember. There being a like a stage kind of thing, but I I know it's also not this one specifically because here we reach a dead end door. Get all kinds of different noises. So, here we cannot get through this door. This door is super duper locked. This is what it looked like. Like, I thought that the the thing was over here, but I know it's not. Ah. Uh, we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. Oh, no, we can't dock here. This is where I really wanted to dock, but we're not gonna be able to because we haven't... We haven't welcomed that building. Well, that's okay. It's We just went on a nice leisurely stroll around the whole establishment. And we're back to where we started. I thought we were gonna be able to get off somewhere and actually do something useful, but I guess not. Fuck. Man. Guessing I haven't figured out how to get into the cave in the middle of the cliff face. Which one? I assume that, you mean? Yeah, no idea. I bet that there's gonna be a door that opens and then goes across and creates a bridge there. Hate it. Absolutely hate it. So, there's gotta be another path here, right? Ooh. I can't blow any of these out. And that's the music. Dang. This is killing me. How do I get to you? Uh, 
Oh man, this game is crazy. Just for the record. I wonder if it's cheating if I go back and watch my VOD to see how I found that area the first time. And that first, like, uh, column puzzle. I still have no idea. It's just a memory aid. I like that. Because, because yeah, this place really is a maze. You're gonna scream? Well, okay, why? No one's no one's keeping you here. Slide burning room, a room full of burned slide reels piled next to a strange device. Found a hidden slide reel that shows a container marked with glowing symbol being handed to a shadowy figure. The figure follows a procession of green lights through a forest to a candlelit building where they carry the container into a secret passage behind a roaring fireplace. Found this uh, hidden slide reel that shows a container. It's weird that it gives the same clue. Do I think I could find that container? I I feel like I must be able to. Like, that's one of the things that I just randomly stumbled across the very first time I got to that area. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry for the uh keeping you get keeping keeping y'all who have played this game on the edge of your seats with excitement and frustration. Did I look at everything, by the way? There were also, so we went to that one. This one we haven't gone to yet. Because it's so fucking hard to see where the hell it is. Fireplace before the procession. I kind of doubt it, but we could try. No, no worries, Pyro. It's better than my, my, like, no ideas. Right? I almost feel like I have too many directions. There's, like, too many different things that I can check out right now. I was avoiding it. I was avoiding it, but we're gonna go to the scary chanty people. A lot of threads, yeah. Oh, I don't like the scary chanty people. I'd rather not. Maybe they'll friendly this time? At least I know what to expect. 
At least I know if I get too close. They're gonna upset me. Light everything up. <gasps> oh, I just realized. How to get through this door! So now I'm here, and I can call a boat. Now I know how to call the boat, okay. I don't know if I want to do that right now, though. Like, I'm glad to know that we can. Yeah, the dead end door, yeah. Okay, cool, so that was that. We're gonna follow this around. Oh yeah, so they're already there. So we can't get there before them. I'm pretty confident of that. Even if we just like beelined it, I think I think we'd be cutting it really close. Assuming that that one that we just saw was the first one, which I'm not convinced it was. Whoops, it's fine. Concert be happening. There's a grabby hand. Where's the grabby hand go? Ho ho, we haven't been here yet. This is a, uh, gotcha. Okay, so there's a shortcut. So without going all the way around, we now know if we go up there, we can, we can, um, shortcut. Yeah. So we can shortcut to here, but what's here? I don't like this. Um, maybe the shortcut is just to get to this bridge? Just 
just let him go by. the edge there's another guy I'm wondering what happens if we go straight to where that light is oh we're way closer than I thought we were oh he's gonna see me nice Kinda waiting for another guy to show up so that it'll light up the area. <sighs> Ooh, spooky. That door is closed. That's where they came from. That door is also closed. Maybe I'm not supposed to... I'm probably just, like, not supposed to be here at all. God. A guy is totally just gonna show up behind me and I'm gonna freak the fuck out and just alt F4. You're not supposed to be there. Why can you be here? I. It just feels out of bounds, you know. I'm trying to remember if there was like a fire. Oh, there's another guy coming. Great. good about this. I don't feel like I'm learning anything right now. Don't you hate getting stuck behind slow walkers? Oh, it's like a hand at the top. That's freaky. Yeah. 
so I don't think I can like go anywhere in here. We're gonna check if there's fire. Hold on, I'm gonna. Oh, all right, never mind. Who <gasps> saved by the bell? <laughs> All right. Okay, what time is it? 10.30? Yeah, I guess not. Yeah, this is the one that first goes underwater. Damn. Okay. Um. All right. Well, I mean, we did make a fair amount of progress. Um. Regardless, we found the secret room. We got wind of more secret rooms. And we know roughly how to get to some new areas. I might call it here for tonight. I'm feeling a little bit extra stressed playing this game than I do normally. Uh, so I might just need a break. Um, to really get into exploring around without as much anxiety. Uh, yeah. That's it's how I'm feeling right now. Uh, but I really want to I really want to find more stuff. Uh, okay. I'm gonna call it here for tonight. But thank you everybody for hanging out. Pyro, thank you for that raid. Um, when we are back probably uh, either tomorrow or Sunday. Depends how plans shake out. Are going to be my next free days. Or even a Saturday during the day stream is, is possible. Um, probably the most likely even. And we'll keep exploring. Let me take a look and we'll see who's online, send over a raid. <laughs>